Well, this is the Module Q, and the Module Q is the latest development within the Module range. And the Module range of tablet presses distinguish themselves by the exchangeable compression module. With the Module Q, we've taken it one step further. Yeah. So really to put the innovation which we have in that range of machines more to the front. Specifically with this machine, what we have done is we have put all our innovations which we had in different machines, which we combined into one machine. Yeah? So you'll get all the good stuff of all our machines into one. It goes from the point of productivity, yeah? where the exchangeable compression module has been completely redesigned to a level where it's much easier, has a much better setup, it's much lighter, uh, and also therefore enhances a much better containment level than it was in the past. So it means that the inside of the machine is completely clean, does not require any cleaning. So that means that you can have a very fast product changeover and allows you to have a much bigger volume of tablets produced over one year time. The other advantage is the flexibility. The exchangeable compression module is an isolated section within the machine that can be removed in minutes. Yeah? Now, by having different types of exchangeable compression modules, we can actually have an ECM or an exchangeable compression module that does single layer, can also do bi-layer, but can also do high-potent products with washing capabilities. So you basically have one basic machine with different types of ECMs that can be used for different types of applications, different types of products. So this machine here is, is now launched officially into the market uh, and the machine will be released for sale yeah, as of a couple of months from now and actually the first machines will be able to be delivered by the beginning of next year. Yeah. In the meantime customers can come and do trials in our facility in Belgium to test their own formulation to see how well this machine performs compared to what they know today.